Hello Central Illinois, it's a rainy night tonight in Boston. Tomorrow's a night where the forecast is madness, pure madness. Two big March Madness games. UConn, the defending champion against San Diego State in a rematch of last year's title game. And then the reason we're here, the Fighting Illini taking on Iowa State. We talked all week about Illinois, the number one ranked offense. Iowa State, the number one ranked defense. But Brad Underwood says that's making this game a little bit too simple. There's a lot more to Illinois than offense, a lot more to the Cyclones than defense. A lot of really good players. Um, they've got a lot of really good players. Uh, they're very talented. They've beaten the number one seed twice. Uh, they're competitive. They're well coached. Brad Underwood is very confident in this Illinois team. He loves this team. He loves coaching this team. He loves coaching with one of his top assistants, his son Tyler Underwood. The Illini offense ranks number one in the country in Ken Palm efficiency. Give credit to the Coach Underwoods. Yeah, Brad Underwood is getting a lot of help, especially on the offensive side from Tyler Underwood, his son and assistant coach. I think offensively, he's he's brilliant. I think he's really good. I think he's really create, creative. He's got an understanding of what fits players and what I like and don't, and um, and, I, and I've learned very quickly to trust that. We play a lot in concepts. We believe in giving our players freedom, uh, and these guys have flourished in that. They, they share the ball. Uh, we call it point by basketball, just keeping the ball popping. I think you see a trend in college basketball that's trending much more to the NBA style of play in terms of spacing, uh, mobile five men. You know, the game's turning into isolations and in space. Tyler Underwood admits at times he has to pinch himself. He can hardly believe he's coaching right next to his dad, his all-time favorite coach, a guy who admires so much, a guy who's so driven to win a national title for Illinois with his son now by his side. I'm the most blessed guy in the world to do this with my dad. I mean, it almost makes me emotional. It's, it's a moment I'll never forget. Uh, again, I'm, I'm so blessed to be able to do this at a university that I love. It, it means the world to me. One thing Brad Underwood is proud of, Tyler is not afraid to question the head coach nor his dad. I challenge my staff all the time to uh, be creative and, and challenge me with new ideas, and he does that. And to his credit, most of his ideas have worked. We've had a few disagreements this year, and, and he's usually right. I'll, I'll, I'll give it to him. But, no, it's been, uh, it's been awesome just being able to learn from him, uh, coach with him side by side. A couple of numbers on that story. Tyler Underwood looks young. He is young. He's 27 years old, a former Illini player. And Tyler talked about .5. That's the Illinois offense. They have .5 seconds to decide what to do. Shoot, attack, dribble, pass, but don't hold the ball. Within .5, do something. That'll be a key tomorrow against Iowa State. If you get rid of the ball quick, they can't trap you. You know the Cyclones will want to trap you. We'll have full coverage tomorrow. Again, it's a late night start. Illinois and Iowa State late night tomorrow, 9-10, the suggested tip-off time here in Boston. We'll have full reports on the early and late news tomorrow on 25